Hello, I'm David and in this video I'm gonna show you how to export Tecla Structure model from new Tecla Structure to old Tecla Structure. Here I have my example model with a couple of columns, beams and connections. Now I select all these items using Select Objects option, then Menu, Export, IFC, I select coordination view and I click export. Now in old Tecla structures I import this as reference model, then show it to be visible. Now using select objects in components option I select these items, then I click tools convert EFC objects and now convert. I hide reference model as you can see the beams were converted correctly the plates were converted correctly but columns are not converted the columns were not converted, probably because we have wrong export settings. Go back to new Tecla structure, double click on column, then user define attributes, and go to EFC export tab. Now we can see that EFC export type for column is set to BREP. Set it to auto, and to be sure, I select all my items in model and override this value with auto auto modify now again i export my ifc model using coordination view 2 i delete all my items from the model I open new file as reference model, set it to be visible, select all items and open tools, convert ISC objects and convert. Hide reference model. Now we see that all columns and beams are imported and also plates but we haven't welds and haven't bolts so this import is more useful than ascii import but is there any option to have better import than this what we can see go back to the new tecla structure select all items Click menu, export, IFC, and set export type to steel fabrication view. Click export. Next, we add this new model as a reference model. We can see the colors are different. Select all items, tools. Convert ISC objects and convert. Now hide the reference model. We can see columns, beams, plates, and because we used steel fabrication view IFC model. We have now holes in our plates and beams. So it's quite better than previously import, but still we have no bolts and no assemblies. That is all. Maybe this video will help you with export import problems. Thank you.